Oh, connectors and connectettes. I thought I was done with you. Thought you were done with me. Bet you were hoping you were done with me, but we've run into another situation. We've got to have a little chat, some girl talk. Uh, this little video here is going to be brought to you by the letter A. And A is for A-hole. Now, what could A-hole have to do with Weight Watchers and food, doing the right things? Well, boys and girls, we're going to have a little lesson about it. Put on your Crocs. We're going on a trip, man. I'm going to show you exactly why. Because I'm working on Saturday, and one of the things we do for the guys on Saturdays is we buy breakfast. And I have been fast food sober for about 15 months. I just stay away from it. Anytime my daughter has got it in the car, it nearly makes me sick. I've become one of those snobs. That, oh, that, like somebody that like, used to drink, used to smoke. Oh, I have no tolerance for drinking a cigarette smoke. Um, you know, I tolerate the fast food just because I got a 14-year-old and that's what she likes. But I do not. It about makes me sick when it's in the car. But here's where the a-hole comes in because the a-hole brought in breakfast. These are some, uh, at one time, delicious breakfast sandwiches that I cannot stomach anymore and I don't eat them. Uh, this came from Hardee's or Carl's Jr.'s, where you might be, but here's what would happen back in the day. We don't know how many people were gonna work on a Saturday. We'd just buy X number of biscuits and there'd always be leftovers, and then the guys would leave and there'd be like six biscuits left over, and I would go in like a big old fatty fatty two by four big boy and go in there and snag me an extra couple of biscuits after they were gone, and it stuff my, about dropped an F, stuff my face because I knew no one was watching and uh, you know what? You're watching, and I'm not going to do it. We've got leftover biscuits. I could feed the homeless with these biscuits, but there are no homeless in this industrial park that I work in. So, boys and girls, we're going to take this, and we're going to do what we should have done back in the day. And I've got a lot of anger and animosity toward these biscuits. Oh, get out of my face. All right. We're at the dumpster. There's trash. Here we go. Watch. Lesson learned. We already feel better about ourselves, don't we? Just because it's there, don't eat it. And that's a problem that I have. Oh, we've got two? Well, I paid for it. I got to finish it when you only really wanted one. Um, don't think that way. Don't pile yourself with fat, sugar, butter, um, and fake happiness. Grab a different kind of breakfast. Got the old trusty banana here. Hello. And... Uh, we're done with the fast food. And I feel better. It's in the dumpster. I'm not eating food out of the dumpster anymore. It's not as delicious as it used to be, but I'm just gonna sit here. Oh, hold on. That chair might fit my personality a little bit better. This little pink chair. But we're gonna sit inside. We're gonna have our banana. We're not gonna eat our sausage and biscuit or bacon, egg and cheese or our waffles. And we're gonna sit here in the chair. We're gonna spin and celebrate the glorious moment that we've just had. Have we learned anything today? Well, the one thing we've learned is throw away crap you're not gonna eat just because you bought it. You don't need it. Eat the banana. And remember that A is for a-hole. Get the a-holes out of your life, people. They're killing you. I love you. Love ya, mean it. Until we meet again, I bid you freaking adieu. But the one thing you need to know is you're the best, I'm the worst, you're fantastic, I suck. Until we meet again, I bid you freaking adieu. Stay classy, connect.